I'm Melanie Dyer. You're watching Live on the Lot on Skippy TV. And today I'm sitting down with Kevin Bennett, Lynn Botel, and Felicity Urquhart. Thanks uh, for coming no, in. It's good to be here. It's so great to have you guys. I mean, separately, you're amazing artists and you've now joined forces. It was sort of thought to be a once-off kind of concert a couple of years ago and I guess it yep. stuck, right? Yeah. It yeah well, technically it was Lynn's idea to just have a sing at Tamworth and do yeah. a... And just do a gig and do some songs and have some fun, really. Yeah. And gang up on an audience a bit. Uh, <laughs> but we did call ourselves another name. We had another name. Yeah. Which was, was country, it? country, Heart and Soul. Ah. Just for fun. Yeah, again, we just again, called it that. that but showed, you're all a bit of showed, everything, really. Yeah. yeah. And that showed what sort of fun we were going to have with this thing just for, just for the once off. And um, I think we enjoyed it so much and worked out that we sounded good together, which is mm. not necessarily a given. No, it's not. You've all got such unique voices, but they really blend together so yeah. well. And you decided to then name yourselves after your last names. <laughs> well, that took a... Well, I'm going to jump oh, in here. That was a last-minute thing too. I literally... Yeah. Be, be, we, after that gig, then we ended up doing some other shows together and thought we should write some songs together and make this a, a proper yeah. thing and probably record. So we did. We got the songs. The album was recorded. We're about to hit press. Yeah. And I call these guys going, I think... We need to go with our own names, not country, heart and soul, I yeah. think. And they went, Well, that was oh. a good call. It was, yeah. a, it was a great call. call. Yeah. 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 Except it's harder to pronounce. Uh, yeah. It's not a good call for people like me. You know, like, okay, yeah, I've got to yeah. work out how to pronounce this. <laughs> <laughs> but it sticks. And you know you've made it when you can just call yourselves by your last names. Well, yeah. well, <laughs> well we're getting better even now. It's BBU now, so it's even Yeah, we kind of, we shortened yeah. it. Yeah. yeah, I can go with that, go with that one. And I mean, the first album, BBU, was such a great success. You picked up two golden guitars. For yeah, the album, that was pretty overwhelming. Yeah. yeah, was it expected? Was that a nice, oh, then uh, nice motivation expected. to keep going? Well, we had five noms, and I remember we'd three the, in. We'd lost the first. We'd three. lost the first three. <laughs> Cabby looks at me and goes, "Done, done, <laughs> good, Lenny. It's, 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 it's all over and over." And I'm like, "No, I got a good feeling." See your heart. <laughs> See your country. <laughs> so, <laughs> so how does that work? Like, do you get one each, or do you have to kind of separate oh, them? On? Yeah. We we do have we them engineered around. it so we. We one could inch. have yeah. one inch. Oh, yeah, you yeah. can buy copies. Yeah, you have oh, to. That's good. You have when to, you win, have obviously, to not. Oh, you, you okay, okay yeah. that's how it works. I was thinking yeah, that so, I'd have so little sleepovers at each other's Yeah, you get one to share, but if you want yeah. to, you can get you can a get couple copies. more. No, yeah. that's good. Awesome. That's good. Well, um, you're also busy, you know, working separately as well um, as doing the the team thing. You're such a super group now. But how did you find time in your schedules to actually sit down and write the albums? <laughs> it, it, not just write it, then record it, and then, then record promoting. It, yeah. Yeah. Everything is a juggle with us, yeah. isn't it? Yep. <laughs> so it's kind of it's many emails and many phone calls later, and usually I'm the person steering the ship on the organisation yes. of that. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Not and usually, always. <laughs> we need our captain. <laughs> yeah, every team like, needs a captain. Hey guys, what are we doing on the 18th? Yes. We're doing yeah. this now. Yeah. You know, yeah. try and make it work. I mean, it, it, for me. Um, it's such an enjoyable endeavour. It's such a wonderful thing to do. We have so much fun and we sound great together. Like, I think it's a really special, unique blend. Mm. Um, so I always make time and we always make time. Yeah. I mean, there's only so much, you know, you can do when you've got 17 bands and two children and <laughs> so 3,000 dogs. And a husband. And oh a my husband. gosh. <laughs> you, respect, <laughs> you just spend time with him. But um, I've got two dogs and a partner, so I'm okay. <laughs> He and I kind of, you know, uh, he's the sound engineer for us and, um, and Glenn Hanna, uh, Fliss's husband, of course. plays yeah. guitar and produces Produce our records, the records with, yeah. so with you guys. Cool. Well, that's good. You still get to spend time with him then. Yes. That's kind of yeah. a bonus. Well, we use our home studio too, Mel, so yeah. it was, that was really, really great. Good. And we had the kids there and we would stop for meal breaks for the kids to keep them alive. Um, <laughs> that's but, kind of important. <laughs> but this is family. It's like, oh, Linny and KB are over. Oh, and cuddles and, yeah. you know, yeah, it is really, really lovely. And, and that's how beautiful these two humans are. And the fact that this is what it's like. We're out. It's family when we get to play together. And it's so different from, from what we do individually. Yeah. And it is a beautiful, fun thing to come to. Yeah. It's, it's really different. good. It's way better than I we all expected, yeah. I think. Yeah. That's just yeah. the way we sound. But I've never been in a band where I had to sing this, this, special, this particular note at a particular time. <laughs> you, if you sing all the time and you sing lead, you can kind of do what you like. And exactly. They, yeah. The other guys have to follow you and this, this, I've got to be there at a certain time, right? Yeah. Now, yeah. Or it's going to well, I mean, good. Lynn, you'd be used to the, awesome. the team yeah. Yeah. I'm used to with harmony. Bella. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm definitely used to the harmony, but I think I'm getting a feel for the bass and how you felt with the harmony. Because mm. I've never <laughs> like, played bass in a group before and you can't just, yeah. you know, 
Yeah, and that's amazing. Fired by that's the just, studio. Uh, it's so, up and sounded yeah, just, good from the word uh, go. So. Well, we put yeah. a lot on this record, and I um mm. I just put it in the dryer, and that's why it's a bit little, but <laughs> it's okay. It's a tiny wee <laughs> the baby. Face. Oh, the, the baby. baby face. Yeah. It's so cute. I love it. It's such oh, a nice okay. addition as well. It just rounds the sound out as yeah. well. And yeah. I try and hide my mistakes as much as possible. <laughs> no. It's okay. We just turn that down. <laughs> we turn that down. <laughs> and what no, about like stylistically? Did you have to sort of um, direct the music towards a sound that you all agreed on, or did you just kind of do it organically? Did it all just fall into place when you started writing? Mm. I think it was organic. I think, mm -hmm. and I think we. We, we've engineered now to keep it simple, acoustic mm. guitars essentially, a bit of percussion that mm. Fliss can do on yeah, the guitar. Yeah, you're good at that. So bass, go. A bit of bass added now, which is really cool. <laughs> yeah. uh, but essentially songs you can sing, we could stand up in the corner and sing our album to people, you know mm. what I mean, like Crosby, yeah. Stills and Ash did when they made their first album. Yeah. Went around all mates places and stood up and sang it to them, you know, yeah. which, was real, which I thought was perfect and that was like a template almost for yeah. that. But, but if you look at our record, there's a country song and a kind of rootsy, minor thing and mm. you know just all bit kinds of, of stuff mm. but when we play it all it welds together I think. Yeah it really does it's so beautiful yeah. and um, there's actually a really special song on the album as well bringing another male energy mm. and presence um, and that's a song a tribute to Carl Brody yeah. and that you wrote that one mm. is that right? Uh, Carl With and I Carl. wrote it yeah. yeah and I thought of it uh, we were looking for songs and we we have this great um, writing thing now where we get together at Fliss's place and we all bring a musical idea to the table mm -hmm. and we all finish it. So even though we could sit at home and finish it. We, we, it's great we, to do it together. You know, yeah. Fliss brings an idea and we work on that and then Lynn has an idea. I've got a chorus, what do you think? It's not a chorus, it's a verse. Oh. <laughs> That's how it works. <laughs> 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 I don't know what but I'm playing it to you. <laughs> yeah. so, so, so we do that and, um, and, and it's really good. But uh, we, we also drag songs in from other people and if we like them and they suit us and stuff like that. But. Uh, I remember I had this song I wrote with Carl and I thought it would be a nice kind of ballad if you want to do a ballad. And I was mm. just thinking of us doing it, you know. And so I, so I went searching for the song and I found it on my garage band and I am like the, the least tech head ever. <laughs> uh, so I thought, oh, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll just find my demo of it. And I found my demo of it and it was fine. played it through and I thought, that might suit, it, suit us, you know. And um, mm. I saw there was another track that wasn't highlighted and I highlighted it and it's Carl playing it. Wow. Teaching me how to use GarageBand, mm. basically. Really? So you'd think it would be all over the place, but he just sat and played and it's beautiful. So we That's used very special. It straight from GarageBand yeah. onto their album as well as, and we used his verse and his choruses. and. His sang, voice sounds like it's there. right there. Just sounds right, and yeah. right in your so face. It's, it's great. Yeah, that's it? the power of music, isn't it? He can, yeah. he can live on through mm. the music. And it makes so. really me cry every time I hear it. Yeah. Gosh. <laughs> and it's called Every Hello Eventually Leads to Goodbye. So it's even wow. more poignant. Yeah. Than it's really it's special. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It is a special song. And, I mean, all of the songs on the album are beautiful. And Weeds is the, the title of the yeah. album. How yeah. did that sort of come about? What does mm. that mean? Um, okay. Well, um, it's, uh, I think, track number four or something. And um, we were looking at titles and trying to find the right one. You know what that's like. When you've it's got hard, a collection like of songs children. and it's got to, <laughs> yeah, and, yeah, and it has to represent the album as much as be a cool title, you yeah, know, and memorable and uh, yeah, yeah, memorable and different and and we were just you know we were thinking about this other generic title and then this kept popping up all the time. I think it was Glenn that said, "I think you should call it that." Mm -hmm. And um, for us, it, it's a really good rep representation, I think, because um, you know some some might call it weeds, but. I think it's a beautiful flower. You know, it's different for everybody. Mm. Weeds, and it's what entanglement, growing together, um, and then there's also the other side of it because I think this album covers definitely, for me, it, it, when I listen to the record, it talks about love, and then we have a look at the world and how it's in crisis mm. and things that are going wrong, and it all starts from home. I think it all starts from internally and then expands outwards. So I yeah. think it's a few songs that talk about that. Am I getting a bit deep? Oh, this I'm is sorry. great. No, I'm, I'm, I'm following you. <laughs> I love to hear the stories behind but, the yeah, songs. So yeah, so when we came across looking at the title, Weed stuck out to mm. us. And then Glenn did this really amazing word. thing with a guitar and he um, played it. He didn't play it. <laughs> no, well, he <laughs> played it as well. <laughs> what that you're was referring to. Threw some flowers <laughs> through he, the hole. He, yeah, he put a, he put, he put the a artwork. Yeah. Yeah. He's beautiful. Yeah. I love that it. Was, yeah, we, we, we were going for a 70s kind of, <laughs> yeah. Emmy Lou kind of Yes, cover, maybe. definitely. It, it like sounds yeah. like that. It's going to be beautiful because out of 
you know, darkness comes light and out of negative stuff, good stuff happens in yeah. your life. Yeah. So I think it has those connotations. And I was and really excited to see Glenn out in the garden. <laughs> <laughs> for, for, you know, half a day, I've got to get this right for the album. <laughs> <laughs> Look at you in he the garden sun. playing with your dirt. Yeah, well. <laughs> That's awesome. No, the artwork is beautiful. It really captures it the like, essence yeah. of the album and the songs and everything it's about. Yeah, so it's really special and it actually just shot straight up the charts to like number three last week yeah, when you released it. on iTunes. That was pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's Happy a good days. sign that Happy it's, it's going to go really well for you guys and yeah. maybe another golden guitar in, in January. <laughs> oh, well. Or two yeah. or three or six. trying not to be too nervous if we get nominated. <laughs> it's just nice to have people liking the songs and yeah. already picking favourites within, you yeah. know, mm. hours of it being released. We had comments like that and that yeah. just nice. fizzes Like, what us. were you thinking? <laughs> <laughs> oh, How did you do that, guys? <laughs> <laughs> That's what you do it for. Yeah, and you're actually headed out um, on tour now to launch the album officially yeah. and yeah. do a few yeah. shows. Where are you headed? Um, well, we'll be at, uh, we're doing New South Wales and then we're heading to Melbourne in November as mm -hmm. well. So um, you can find out all our tour dates on our website. Okay, and yeah. that's BBU or is it Bennett 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 or a Facebook? <laughs> awesome. Yeah. Well, okay. hopefully everyone can get to a show. Bennett Botel and Urquhart. <laughs> <laughs> you guys need a sit in order. Oh, Come on, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming in to have a chat. Thanks, Thanks so much, Mel. Thank you.